The water has been flowing at the intersection of Dix and Mellon since October. It's not just the waste of the water, and that's a big part of it, but it's the safety factor. And it's just too bad you have to go push so hard to get it done. Repeated calls to the city from one of the businesses on the corner got nowhere. But after our story on the problem aired Monday on Action News at 6, things started happening. If we knew that we could get this kind of fast, good action, we would have called Channel 7 a long time ago. It was impacting the business, the safety, everything that was going on on this corner it's impacting because th this ice just kept piling up and piling up and piling up. The street kept getting narrower and narrower, but the traffic didn't let up. Imperial Construction is the contractor hired by the Detroit Water and Sewerage Department. Crews have been attacking the problem first in the middle of dicks. I'm thrilled that you guys come out and you spent your time and, and you helped us. That uh, doesn't happen that, that easy anymore. This is not a big political deal. This is the, the southwest part of Detroit. It's uh, high taxes and low, uh, low uh, population, so we don't rate very high. Water service to the Star Grill will be interrupted temporarily tomorrow, but that's a minor inconvenience to owner Mike Mahale, who's thrilled the larger ongoing problem here is finally going to be resolved. In Detroit, Dave Llewellyn, Channel 7, Action News.